There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. So it's your girl April and I'm back to do another affordable wig video. So I'm going to tell you guys something, a little secret that you just don't know about me. I love affordability, okay? So yes, I'm one who loves to be cheap and I just think that you can just do a lot more, you can buy a lot more if you are just budget friendly. So I really prefer to do the, the budget friendly videos overall. So with this one, um, I do have a new unit by Bobby Boss and this is available at sisterwigs.com and her name is Shannon. So yes you guys, she is so pretty. Like she is in the color number four, she's absolutely gorgeous. The number four kind of reminds me of the number two for like another wig site or other websites. Um, this really honestly is to me like a number two. But either way, here nor there, this is like a banging wig, y'all. Like for real, lace is coming through, honeys, okay? Lace come through the perfect curved part. And you know what? Okay? First of all, she is like... She about to be my new boo, okay, besides the man on his shirt. So, first of all, I am getting ready for mm, The Walking Dead Season 7. So, for those of you who are with me on that, holla if you hear me. Just leave your comments below of what you going to think about um, Season number 7. Are you guys ready? Have you been watching Fear the Walking Dead? I have. I kind of like it now, but... Nothing can replace The Walking Dead. So I am super ready. It is on Netflix season six. So I have been re-watching every last season like I've been doing, okay? But anyway, so yes, my man Daryl, he is here to represent. And as well as that as, yes, Shannon. I do like the name a lot. And I do love the curl pattern. Plus the hair texture, it is more or less like that yakky texture, natural texture wig, y'all. And... For some reason, she is kind of giving me these vibes that remind me of some other wigs that I'm just so much in love with. Now, the actual model, she's really not doing it right. Like, no, they did not style it on her right. But that's okay. It's okay. She got a nice amount of parting in this unit. I did tweeze a little bit, but if you don't want to, you really don't need to. But I did tweeze a little bit. Um, there are combs right by the part and I, you know something I'm getting so used to that like I'm over it now like for real I'm just like over it and there is a comb and the adjustable straps in the back so yes you guys let's go ahead and put this on because I am ready what about you guys I'm ready to ready to put this wig on y'all let's get ready get ready put this wig on y'all and then y'all tell me what you think about her and what wig does she remind you of so as the norm I do have my handy dandy products. I have my favorite Aussie Instant Freeze. I do have my Topic Hair Building Fibers in the color Dark Brown. I do have my brush for my um, makeup as well as I am going to also use a beauty blender. I do have a comb, a brush, and instead of my e.l.f. I'm going to be using my Black Opal True Colors Stick Foundation in the color Kalahari Sand. This color is even better, like it really, really matches. Like, it's not the same color complexion as my scalp, but it is the same color complexion as my actual face. So what we'll better way to blend it in, y'all, blend it in. So I'm gonna take it, and I'm gonna just take this, and I'm gonna run it across the lace on the inside. You know what I'm saying? Take my beauty blender, and just kinda like smudge it all in the seam. Now, I didn't say this going to work, but I'm trying it out. Because the lace is hard plastic, sometimes you got to do a couple little extra steps. And this might not have been one of them, okay? But we all entitled to messing up. So, I'm going to just take my brush and I'm going to smear it in. Because the beauty blender is not getting in to the little crevices and such. So, on the outside, it does look a little bit better, as you can see, from just from the brush. And then I'll take the beauty blender and kind of like pinch it and get into that lace. Get in that lace, y'all, yes. All right, you guys, let's do this, let's do this. Hold me close till I 
get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. And I you guys to think about who she reminds you of because I told y'all before I told you ladies before I told y'all that each company seems like they are making the same style same version but their own version so Bobby Boss Shannon she is so pretty okay now she reminds me of Falami um, by Features Equal. She reminds me of Montessa by It's a Wig. She also reminds me of the one that I just did, Blue Meadow. She reminds me of Blue Meadow by Model Model. Okay, so each one of them all have some similarities to one another, okay? This one, I like this one. They all have like that same type of hairstyle and I love it because for one, you don't have to keep wearing it like this. Ladies, you can just like flip it up, pull your hair up, do something funky because this is what, well, normally I have my edges down. So just pretend that my hair is down on the sides, okay? Pretend, like act like it's really there, you know what I'm saying? Um, and I'll just like pull it up and like do something like this and have it going down like that and I'll wear it like that. Yes, I love these wigs, especially because of the style because this is me. I love the swoop bang. I love the part right here. I love the hair texture and I love the length. So this is me and the volume, the volume, the vol voluminous, everything about this wig. I love it because it resembles so of my so many of my other um, synthetic units that when one goes bad, I got another one to put on. You know what I'm saying? I don't have to be like, oh my God, I got to order another one. Oh my God, I got to order another one. I don't have to be like that no more because let me tell y'all something. I was about to be in tears when Robust was out of stock and she was getting ratty at the ends. I was about to cry. Yes, Sister Wigs, I was about to cry, okay? But then they came through. They came through with some other matching style. So a diva, a girl was like, yes, hunties, coming through. See my lace wig. Mm. Okay. So that's how I felt. So with this one, I know it's extra, but I'm liking Shannon. This is like probably like the second Bobby Boss wig that I've done in like a couple of months. I don't really do too many of this, but I'm feeling this one. So yes, check out sisterwigs.com. I will post all of their info below and make sure you check out their makeup website as well, Sister21, because I sure did use my Highlight Color Concealer LA Girl and a couple of other things from that website. Really cheap, inexpensive cosmetics, build up your makeup game. Girls always you can always look on fleek on a budget. Yes, beauty on a budget. So on that note, all the information will be posted for you girls down below. Let me know what you think of this one, Shannon, right here. I'm feeling it. I like the name, too. It is totally different. And I will see you girls on my next video. I forgot to mention that... For those of you who are concerned, will she fit? Is the cap big enough? Well, for me, I had to kind of scrunch it down in the back. So it is a little bit spacey on me. So yes, if you have a lot of hair or if your head is a little bit bigger, it will fit, okay? And I have the hooks really tight too. So yes, it will fit. So yeah, you guys, I guess I will go now and 
Yes, I love you guys and stay diva and divalicious. <laughs>